Now, I don't even know what episode of Empire this is, but it was lit AF. I was here for it. Can we get into it? Let's go. So, not really uh, sure how it started, but let's get into Miss. Um, how can we say this nicely? Hoity toity. Freak Frack Bob Run, Miss Ann Coulter. That's what tease I got from this episode. Homegirl walks into Cookie's establishment saying that uh, everything is cute and grand. I'm having this, what is this? Some fashion deal. Tiana starts slaying the serve and doing the song and just let them have it like, like she always does, giving everything in life slaying the servant and I forgot her name so I'm calling Ann Coulter Ann Coulter was like I love her I love her style of everything about her let's keep her just make sure you do something to her head it doesn't need to be poofy make it straight like my bob or my mop however whatever you want to call it but it's not Aesthetically pleasing like these models I have and every stretch of the runway and how they walk I want everything to be lovely and classy. In my head. I'm thinking like bitch Your her Ain't classy Your her ain't even your her But okay, and so the whole time he's like oh, of course hun yes and uh, she's this and I will make sure that happens and all that good stuff. So that's that. And um, at this point, Tiana's already nervous and she's like, okay, whatever. So Cookie comes and tells her, yeah, do this for her, do this. And she was like, do what? You want me to do this? You want me to do that? I don't even like Homegirl, which would we'll pause her right there. So after all that, <clears throat> I want to say Cookie goes to Andre and she was already mad at him because he missed out on a dinner and he was like well mom I did what you did you know you hooked up uh, I forgot his name still got a groove back so I'm going to hook up Nessa and can Nessa follow Tiana and she was like well girl I guess but you know how Tiana is she crazy anyway so but yeah do it so once we get into the whole little deal. Uh, Portia's up in there. I'm like, yes, well, she is, yes, yes. Portia's in that mood. And she's like, yeah, you need to do this. You look dope, girl. You don't like this. You don't like which country she wearing. You don't like which one. Girl, that's dope. And she was like, come here, Nessa. Can you take this off? Nessa, take out the dread, the whatever it is, the roll. This fool puts the roll on the curling iron. Red flag number one. I think it was a curling iron. Whatever it is, it, it burned. Red flag number two. Was her just observing and looking and once uh she started talking she's like oh my god you messed up the dress and you did this and you did that and then when I yeah when I tell you homegirl Sorrel acting her butt off from this point she's like I don't even want to work for this woman she bougie and she only doing this cause she need black people in her collection cause they already called her racist I'm like girl when I tell you she went all the way in she went all the way in i was here for it so yeah but the whole time she went in somebody was recording her from inside and they thought it was the camera but it wasn't the camera and lo and behold nessa and andre had something to do with it andre we was room for you but now i'm done with you so yeah that's that we get to um I forgot what his name was, y'all. What is this boy's name? The one that's trying to frame uh, Lucius. He trying to dig up dirt on everybody. He see everybody's out to eat. And I guess they're on to him. But he, you know, grabbing his mom. He's then the dude in the car. He's like, oh, don't, you know, don't go into the car. I mean, don't come out because we don't have enough evidence. To say that he's doing anything to his mama. So they got him leading on that. In the meantime. Jamal trying to get. Why is Jamal and that boy not dating yet? Y'all. 
bitch from the last episode where Carol saw him. She like, but she let me let me fill on him, girl. Yes. So yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, yeah, I can't say that about it. But yeah, he's like, look, we're gonna uh we're gonna product place, but first we're gonna show you this virtual reality thing. Boop, less commercials. So yeah, put that on. He's tapping everything. <laughs> Lucia sat sitting there to say you putting uh wires on your nipples. I'm like, bitch, did you catch somebody with some wires? That's how you caught somebody in the last season, right? But yeah, moving on. So what's the name? Want to find this center? Want to find what the problem is? And everything worked out, and his stuff was okay when he, you know, saw Freddie Gas shoot him, and then he shot out audience. But as soon as Lucius came in, everything started fluctuating, and all this started happening. He was like, "What are you doing to my son?" Blah blah blah. This. He was like, "Look, we're trying to find this trigger. Got to got him." He was like, "Were you doing it? Just know, if you don't perform, you don't eat." And the people that are performing, that well, he said the last episode. But this time, he was like, "Look, you just better not mess up, cause this will be your last performance, and you can be an independent artist." I was like. Really now? Really? So after all that said and done, dude was like, look, bro, it's not everything around you. Lucius is your post traumatic stress. He was like, Lucius? Of course, you know, Lucius is everybody's stress level, but that's not going to stop me. Yada, yada. So that was that. Um, What else we got? Uh, So Nessa and Andre plotting and ish. And Cook is like, who's gonna get this together? They already know that Tiana, you know, they afforded everything where Tiana was talking to, about Ann Coulter on, you know, on set and how she was a racist. Ann Coulter don't curl. So once <laughs> Andre goes to try to stop it, y'all. And so she was like, look, I want to get Ellie Gold, and she fits the brand. And what was cute was the little girl knew uh, some of uh, um, Tiana's songs and was dancing to it, and I was laughing. But what was a key was Andre was like, your daughter has such beautiful hair, unlike you, and I know you love playing in her hair. I was like, what this mean? So once that's all said and done, he was just like, look, I know you're looking. You should look for somebody pure and somebody that's black. And this girl named Nessa is just amazing at what she does. She's a free artist and she's new. And she'll free your brand because she's not just a crossover. She's a black, beautiful woman and all that good stuff. So in my head, I'm like, mm. she knew what she was doing. She knew exactly what she was doing. Oh, Lord, that like got real bright. So, yeah, that... uh was his plan and she started thinking because she was like no thank you he was like well enjoy your night baby when old girl when the little girl woke up she went from looking like uh america's next time model to looking like donald trump when he in election office i'm like girl they snatched that baby ball they snatched the, they snatched the ball they snatched the ball <laughs> I was like, are you guys serious? I out of my mind. <laughs> so the next scene the next scene the like, oh, we're going with NASA. She's hot, she's hip, she was doing the whole little salon thing with my hair and all that stuff. And cookie looking like mm. Looking at Andre like, I see you. And then soon as, you know, they get up stage, she's like, oh, that's cute. And what was cute was Tiana and Andre, you know, Tiana and Hakeem were watching. First of all, Hakeem knew it was Andre. He set him up in his office. He's like, look, I know what's good, but Andre kind of checked him at the door. So as Tiana and Hakeem are watching... He was, she was like, that could be me. You know I could have did that better. You know could I could have did that. And he's like, yeah, but don't even worry about it. And he turns on uh, Creed. And how about her? she eating ice cream? Homeboy started twisting her. He was like, you know, I got a girl. I got to learn. I was like, let me find out. They're trying to get back together because they were trying to paint them together like Rihanna, uh, Rihanna and Chris Brown. Which is some tea in itself. But yeah. That was that. That was cute. So, yeah, we're getting into it. 
This thing with a Nika, babe. Babe. Anika was like, you know what, Lucius, I'm tired of saving you. And she had this little black, I don't know what get up it was, but it was nice. Some maybe from Victoria's Secret or I don't know what. Maybe it was Ann Coulter's collection. So, she started picking up vases and picking up glassware and picking up stuff from Timothy Hood and uh, George Washington collection and stuff like that and breaking it. And she was like, you were supposed to give me that A&R, but you gave it to Shine. Just to go going in and going in and going in. Homegirl got on that table, dropped him down, and was ready to go to work. When I sex, kitten, realness, sex, kitten, honey, no cougars in the house. You better 1991 as your banks in this mug, but yeah. So all that happened. Mama walk in. She's like, "You guys do this right? Eat." He was like, "I was about to get a little snack myself." I'm like, "You about to? I think about to get that box out." I'm like, "Girl, okay." <laughs> so yeah that was cute so with all that said and done homegirl got up I forgot what she called I think she said that high yellow uh, that high yellow girl stayed on the table and they went to go talk and I y'all thought Lucian was on choke her but he did he was fixing the tie and he was like you told her, told, I told you to tell him everything. She's like, yeah, baby, I told him everything. I even talked about the old times. Man, forget you, he was even talking about, you know, stuff about you and being bad stuff. He was like, I love your crazy but mama. He walked out the door. But, y'all, the ending. Jamal brought Andre and Lucia. Andre. And Hakeem together. And Andre is. Yeah I'm done Andre. I, I loved him. I had to throw him to the wayside. Because he's still talking to Ronda. And Ronda is messing up his life. So. Jamal started singing about. Daddy this and daddy that. And how daddy broke up a good home. And walks Lucius. Lucius sat down and listened to the whole song. When I tell you Jamal was spilling all the tea. All of it. And after everybody finished, uh, Cookie was like, you can use that, Jamal. Just like she did last time. But Lucia was the main one. was like, hold up. You want to get mad at me for protecting my family? Hold up. Freddy Cats? You think that was me? He Snitch. Snitch. Snitching. Lucius was definitely a snitch. So, once that happened, uh, just, I think I Cookie was like, it's not black and white or something like that. Jamal still was like, I ain't got time for y'all. I'm done. Y'all I'm y'all gonna come to me. Y'all gonna stay. Everybody stay quiet. And Lucia started laughing. He was like, yeah, you don't know half of the story. You don't know half of the stuff that I done for this family. He just, he just, they spit all the tea that last little, that last little good five minutes. I was like, okay, let me. Lucia has got that permit. He definitely feels himself reading for filth. That's what this episode was called. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, it was it was good. I can't wait to I think it's what another episode until I mean it's the last season finale is next week. So I'm ready. It was good. What's up with it?